We are very glad to hold this whole other global meeting here in Portugal, having around 400 representatives from all around the world joining us here for uh, three days of very intensive discussion about the future. We are here actually to shape the future. And we're not only inviting business people, but we're also inviting representatives of certain governments. We have uh, the Prime Minister of Portugal, the President of Portugal, Minister of Economy, Minister of Foreign Affairs, and many other uh, stakeholders, including um, religious leaders. It's the first time we are hosting uh, a session with religious leaders focusing on trust and how do we can rebuild trust. We believe in togetherness. It's a major topic, the theme of the summit. So we'd like to involve all stakeholders, business, governments, civil society and religious leaders. Well, I'm very thankful to be with such distinguished guests here. Thank you very much for including me. Religion that is freely chosen, that is chosen by the heart, which is the case in, in all free societies, is a, is a thing that lifts the society. And I just wanted to say that this trust and togetherness is fostered tremendously by uh, all of the religions represented here and many others across every continent. I am very thankful to be able to meet tonight with Prime Minister Antonio Costa and to uh, thank him for his participation in helping us uh, obtain the property so important for the new temple being built here in Lisbon. And uh, of course we are honored to be able to have these experiences and, and be with them. You know, it is an honor to sit on a platform alongside leaders of other faith traditions. I've spent the whole of my life working um, not in a silo, but actually yeah. with people uh, outside the church, with different denominations within the church, and with people who have no faith at all. And one of the things I'm most passionate about um, is that we learn to turn from being back to back yeah. to face to face but then actually to go out shoulder to shoulder. All the panelists were very interesting people and were, were good people. And you can see how those of us of goodwill must gather together on causes that we can all support. We might have doctrinal differences. Canon Snyder of the, of the Anglican Church, Cardinal Turkson from the Vatican. These are people who are around the world doing good, trying to help uh, the poor, refugees, trying to be a force for, for peace. And uh, we want to participate in these sorts of things with them. We want more and more to speak to others outside of our, our own congregations. The 12 are to be a, a testimony of Christ to all the world.